Now to the Trump presidency and Mike Pompeo, the director of the CIA and President Trump's nominee to be the next secretary of state, pulled off a secret visit to North Korea over Easter weekend. The trip comes ahead of a planned summit that will have President Trump and Kim Jong-un meeting face to face. President Trump praised CIA Director Mike Pompeo's secret trip to North Korea Wednesday. Had a great meeting with Kim Jong-un and got along with him really well, really great. The meeting was to lay the groundwork for a face-to-face -face summit between the North Korean dictator and President Trump later this year. We'll be having meetings with Kim Jong-un very soon. It'll be, uh, that'll be taking place uh, probably in early June or a little before that, uh, assuming things go well. It's possible things won't go well or we won't have the meetings. The president said five summit locations were under consideration. The two most likely are a neutral spot in the demilitarized zone separating the north and south or on a U.S. Navy vessel off the Korean Peninsula. Pompeo is meeting with senators on Capitol Hill as part of the confirmation process to be secretary of state, and lawmakers only learned about his North Korea trip when the press reported it. If uh, truth and being forthcoming as the secretary of state nominee is one of the standards we'd like to see for the next secretary of state, I think he failed that. Pompeo's confirmation as Secretary of State is still up in the air, with Republican Senators Jeff Flake and Rand Paul saying they do not support Pompeo's nomination. But President Trump says at least one senator may change his mind. Rand Paul is a very special guy, as far as I'm concerned. He's never let me down, and I don't think he'll let us down again. President Trump says he's not worried about Pompeo's confirmation vote. Senator Paul says that he talked with President Trump this afternoon, and at the president's request, he will meet with Director Pompeo to talk about their differences.